This video is a lifesaver for all Blackmagic Design users who run any of their Decklink or Intensity cards. I personally use two Decklink Quad HDMI cards with four 4K60 inputs each. I use also the Decklink Mini Recorder 4K and bunch of Decklink Mini Monitor 4K cards. All those are great products and unbeatable for their price and performance. But all those amazing Blackmagic Decklink cards will become absolutely useless if you use them on macOS Big Sur and in a good will you will install latest Blackmagic desktop video app bundle which is necessary to make any Blackmagic card working. After installing it and rebooting the system the desktop video app will be working but it will unfortunately not find any Decklink card at all. It gave me a lot of headaches, panic and tons of wasted time and money until I find solution for this problem. So in this video I will show you step by step tutorial how to fix this Blackmagic desktop video decklink problem on macOS Big Sur. Hi, if you are new here, I'm Teresa from Morgonau.cloud and I provide personal individual support with Apple Mac, Windows, Linux and server builds. So if you would need any help, just join my website membership. Link is in this video description. And I will personally help you 101 while Skype video call and remote session directly to your computer in front of your eyes. In my 2019 Mac Pro, I have Blackmagic Decklink Mini Monitor 4K used for HDR color grading on my 55 inch OLED here on top of me. It was working perfectly with older desktop video app and older macOS Big Sur version. But to make it working, I had to do all the steps which I will show you in this video. Because new versions of macOS and desktop video came out, I decided to update everything but forget it will fail. So let's have a look how to fix it. First of all let's demonstrate the problem. I'm on latest macOS Big Sur 11.4 version and I uninstalled old desktop video app and then installed version 12 which was at the time of shooting this video the newest one. App is installed and running but it can't see any Blackmagic Decklink card. And as you can see here, I did already granted all permissions to this app, so it's not listed here anymore. Okay, so how to fix this? I don't know if to blame Apple or Blackmagic, but solution is pretty simple, but involves to use terminal and also booting to recovery mode. But don't worry, I will show you now step by step the easiest way. Problem lies in some leftover file hidden deeply in system folders. Even if you will uninstall the desktop video app, it will still stay here. So we need to get rid of this, so we have again clean state. Here as you can see I tried to delete that without needing of rebooting to recovery and disabling the system integrity protection, but that obviously didn't work. So we really have to boot into the recovery. Despite I use terminal as super user, it's simply not possible to delete that file. So let's reboot to recovery mode. When your computer will start, immediately hold down on your keyboard the command and R keys until you see the Apple logo. Then enter a password for your user account. In top menu choose utilities and terminal. Now just type this short command CSR util disable and hit enter. You can find all commands needed in this video description. As confirmation you can see it wrote system integrity protection is off. Great, so now just reboot back to the system. Open terminal application, copy and paste this command from video description and hit enter. Done! This time the delete process went fine thanks to the zip disabled. For all cases I deleted also the decklink kernel extension. Perfect, so now reboot back to the recovery mode and enable back the system integrity protection. Type CSR util enable and hit enter. As verification, terminal wrote me system integrity protection is on. Now just normally install latest Blackmagic desktop video app. Blackmagic updated it in the meantime to 12.1 version. Nice. Now restart your Mac. After reboot, if you are doing it for the first time, you will be prompted to allow this app through the system gatekeeper. If not, simply go to system preferences, security and privacy and on the bottom you will see the Blackmagic app listed, so just click on allow. 
it did not ask me anymore now because I already allowed access to it before during my dozens of attempts to make it work. Bang! As you can see, the Blackmagic desktop video app is installed. It's also in my system preferences and finally it can see my Decklink Mini Monitor 4K card and it's correctly listed also in the system report. Oof, that was a challenge. So much time and money lost due to this stupid issue. Now, thanks to my super easy tutorial, you can have it working in just a few minutes, so you don't have to undergo all that pain yourself. And don't forget, if you would need any help with Apple Mac, Windows, Linux or server build, just join my website membership, link is in this video description. And I will personally help you while Skype video call and remote session directly to your computer in front of your eyes. Make sure you click the subscribe button below, hit the bell next to it and choose all notifications, so you won't miss any of my future videos. So, I hope I made your day again little better. If so, please click on the like button below and click also the share button, so it can help to more people and that will in return also help to this channel and help me to produce for you more interesting video like this in future. So, that's all for today. Thank you for watching, take care and see you by my new video or live stream. Bye bye my Macintosh friends.